Acrofab was founded in 1979 to build input devices, keyboards, for a company called Keytronics. From there we grew the business mostly surrounded around precision sheet metal fabrication. We uh, were faced with challenges in how to reduce waste, improve our uh, efficiencies in that area, as well as really wanting to do the right thing environmentally. So we contacted Impact Washington and asked for their advice and fortunately they steered us towards the Department of Ecology and, and that's how we got our start. Our role um, in Impact Washington is uh, one of trying to improve or enhance the performance of um, ACFAB. The work with the Department of Ecology dovetailed so nicely into that because we were able to use the same tools with the same end in mind, and that is to be good stewards of the um, environment and at the same time look for opportunities to financially strengthen the business. We uh, brought the right resources to bear. It is amazing how closely waste in lean and waste in product value streams align with waste in environmental. There were reservations about bringing the Department of Ecology in and what would the dynamics of that be and how would that work. But once we sat down, uh, that hesitant went out the window because they were really good at helping us figure out what was legal and what wasn't. The tree team, the lean and environment team here at Ecology were all what we considered it's like non-compliance, non-enforcement. Um, technical assistance so we don't have the ability to enforce on businesses we know the regulations because we work at ecology I believe they were a little skeptical at first um, coming in because of their uh, initial experience with the zero discharge our first try was dangerous it was uh, very expensive it worked for about three hours it basically got nothing out of it so until they sat down with us we would have been stumbling blind again people like Dusty and Bob were really enthusiastic about figuring out what was really going on in their process what was the reason that waste was being generated they became very interested in identifying ways of eliminating waste at the source and then that became kind of a snowball effect if you will for getting better and better throughout the process the team forming um, everyone just had the same goal when those kind of things come together that's kind of when the magic happens and instead of having to treat and move 1,500 gallons of water every week, they were down to one barrel, which is 55 gallons, so they're much happier. They're doing a lot less work. It's a real number. We are saving $179,000 a year. We really view this as a a win-win a project because what ultimately ended up being good for the environment and reducing our environmental waste also was very good for the bottom line we were able to achieve tremendous cost savings in the process. Being able to combine Impact Washington's lean experience and lean background along with Ecology's um, technical expertise and guidance, being involved in that on the, on the front end to help us design solutions and not just come in on the back end on the compliance end makes a huge difference. This was a successful project with tremendous uh, waste savings and cost savings that probably never would have happened if we would not have been able to come together in this partnership the way that we